Guest but a fan TV outside Deep Deal. We've just been Preston North End 3 2. Ian, couldn't believe what I was seeing in the second half, mate. Yeah, what a finish. I mean, <clears throat> I've lost my voice, you know, screaming there. That, that's what a weird day is it about, aren't it? You know? Uh, but it was a game of two halves. I mean, the first half, you know, we were appalling, really. I mean, they, they, they passing the ball, we made them look like Brazil. Uh, we were a, a yard behind the pace. Uh, but I think then we got into the second half. For me, the, the change was when he brought on uh, Rudy. He absolutely transformed the game. He's doing what we, we paid 15 million for Brit for, and that's to basically defend from the front to get that ball, hold it up, and, and you know, bring other people in. To, ju to jump and compete with centre halves, that, that's what we want, Ian, wasn't it? And he, the lad was doing it. Yeah, I mean, he played right across the, that, that, that front line, you know, he, he was, he, everything he was chasing, everything that went in, he won. I didn't think he lost a header. Everything that went to Britain the first half just bounced off him or he, he was knocked off it. But, you know, in fairness, that's not his kind of play. You know, he's, he, he plays off the shoulder of the of the defender and, and so we're not playing it with strength like that. When you get a Rudy, yeah, OK, some people face a bit of long ball, but, but he wins everything. And I think what he also did today was he brought the best out of Triori. You know, he was getting up, he was getting those flicks and Triori then is, is getting around the back as well. You know, he's playing around the back of that defender. So, no, it was great. I think the first half we looked, you know, really, you know, Scrappy at the back, you know. Another back post goal, you know. We all seen. We were right behind. I guess we seen that coming, you know. We were all shouting yeah. the back post, and he's in, and we knew. But ah, uh, oh, doesn't matter, you know. I mean, at the end of it, you know, there was limbs everywhere, wasn't there? When it was three, so I was, you know, used to jumping all over, screaming, and you know, just that's what it's about, isn't it? When we seen Housen get the ball on the edge of the box, then he turned their two players, and as soon as it left his boat. It was going right for your face, mate. I could oh, see that going like, in the yeah, corner. Yeah, I was there to catch it, man. Yeah, no, yeah. it was beautiful. Great goal, Housens. Oh yeah, uh, you know, and I'm pleased to see him doing well. You know, as we all say, you know, he, he wasn't so good, but now he's all right. But yeah. uh, you know, no, he's he, he's a good player. Uh, I thought uh, again today, Downing. Uh, uh, you know, I, I'm so glad for the lad because he deserves it. You know, he, he, you can see there. You've seen him at the end. The passion. He just he just loves the club. He loves playing. You know, he's enjoying his football. And he is, he is a class above players when he's on that pitch. You know, good players, they make time. They make space. You know, ball, you know balls will come in tight spaces and he never looks under pressure. It's so one touch. He's, he was all over across the park. You know, for me, we were talking about a number 10, you know. In this league, all day down and yeah, he done the same against Sheffield Wednesday and he just run the show once he went into that position. Eh? Yeah, and at and the end, you know, you've seen him coming over at the end there and you've just seen his face, you know, he's, he's banging the badge and, he, you know, he's loving it and, you know, it, it's fantastic to see you. Away days like this, get in. Ian, thanks for coming on for a fantasy. Yeah.